Hi, it's Kenalyn. Today I'm sharing this grab and go dessert. Perfect for your next picnic. Let's go. Start by cooking down your choice of berries and add two tablespoons of honey. I'm using one and a half pints of blueberries, raspberries, and strawberries. Stir this and cook it down until juice is released and it starts to bubble. Use a fork or potato masher to break down the berries. You can choose to keep it chunky or, for a smoother consistency, mash all of your berries and pass it through a mesh strainer. Continue to cook until slightly thickened. Turn off the heat and add in your chia seeds. Stir that in and let it cool in the refrigerator. To make the crust, pulse your choice of graham crackers or cookies in a food processor. Pulse until you have crumbs, then add your softened butter. For a vegan option, use coconut oil instead. Continue to process until you have a wet sand consistency. We are going to take about two tablespoons of the crust and press it into the bottom of our mason jars. These are four ounce mason jars. Keep the mixture pretty loose so that it's easier to spoon out when everything sets. For the cheesecake filling, whip one package or eight ounces of softened cream cheese until smooth. Add a little bit of lemon juice for some brightness. Next, add half a cup of condensed milk and continue mixing. For a vegan option, use coconut condensed milk. Add in a teaspoon of vanilla for flavor and mix until well combined. We are going to take this mixture to fill up a piping bag or a sandwich bag with the corner tip cut off so that we can easily fill our little jars. Using even pressure, fill the jars about 3 quarters of the way up. For the finishing touch, top the cheesecakes with the homemade berry chia jam. Just about a tablespoon for each little jar. Then, gently place the lids on the jars and let it set in the fridge for at least 30 minutes before digging in. And there you have it. Cute little portion control cheesecake jars with homemade berry chia jam. For more recipe inspirations, make sure you hit that like and follow button.